It was cool, but bitch, I'm fine with that. Uh, Ain't gonna lie, get me turned up. Uh, uh, I was cool, but bitch, I had enough. I had to run it up. If I want it, I'ma get it. Tell them add it up. Sneaky bitches, stay up in my DM, trying to grab a buck. Grab. I'm excited that we back. Oh, yeah, I'm I'm excited that we it was back. cool, but bitch, I had enough. I had to run it up. Run it up. If I want it, I'ma get it. Tell them add it up. Sneaky yeah. bitches, stay up. What's good with y'all, man? What's up with y'all, Protechians, Tech Fan, Protech Fan, whatever you want to call yourselves? It's your boy Tone from the PSN Command Network, known as the Protech Sports Network, and I'm back with another video. AT the Great Golf. Our guys are right now, guys, open doors, people, all from people, NGs on in pretty Today's video, we're going to talk about Eric B. Enemy. And Eric B. Enemy is trying to throw me off, bro. And I, I told brother come holler at me last week, Slim. And I ain't like how he had the game plan versus the Bears. And the second half of this Falcons game, wasn't much better. So let's talk about it real quick, right? So this uh, is a trend I've been noticing about Eric B. Enemy that it's kind of throwing me for a loop, right? And it's kind of starting to get on my nerves a little bit. Uh, it's starting to annoy me ever so slightly. And we're going to talk about it. So there's a trend with Eric B. Enemy. After his first 25, 27 play calls, the creativity's out the goddamn on window sometimes. I don't know what the hell. He just dropped back Sam. Spread them out. These gun runs and all this simplistic stuff. Like, there's no creativity in the play calls after the first <clears throat> 25 or 30 plays. It seemed like he's not getting his playmakers fully involved. He's gotten better with getting Terry McLaurin involved, but it seems like he's not getting Han involved enough. And I know Han ain't creating a ton of separation himself right now. And I'm going to dig in Jahan a little bit later. I'm not going like, to absolve Jahan Dotson by any stretch of imagination. But, bro. Scheme him open. He did in the Eagles game for the game time touchdown. Where's that more often? And he schemed him open in, in the uh, Falcons game. Hong got to catch that. But shout out to Louis T for this. He made a good point yesterday in his live stream, or two days ago now when this video is dropping on Sunday. We were saying that give him a touch early. You know what I'm saying? A screen, a hitch, a slant. Something to where he gets the ball in his hands and gets confidence early in the game, right? And that's something that he's not doing for uh, – Jahan right now. He's not getting confidence. He's not getting the confidence he's looking for. And uh, that's a problem. We need we need, we need need Han to have that confidence, man. In order for him to have that confidence, he needs to get the ball early. Uh, we've been doing a great job getting Terry the ball early, but not enough for Han, and that's, that's a problem. Number two, the run game is not creative. I don't see enough Jeff sweep, Jeff sweeps with Curtis Samuel. All these gun runs, not enough uh, eye formation runs. I think Brian Robinson is best running the I formation with a fullback behind him. You have Alex Arm on the roster. How about you go I formation under center? I know Sam's not the best under center, but you're running the daggone ball and like you're throwing it. So, yeah, maybe you can do some bootlegs off of that. You know what I'm saying? To get the, the, to uh, uh, switch the launch point for Sam and stuff like that, too. We need to see more I formation in me, too. That's another problem I have with Eric being in me. Um, it's not enough different formations to kind of throw off a defense, you know? So this is my quick issues with Eric bien uh, I need He needs to get Jahan more involved in the ball game. I think early and often. Uh, I think Han should be in at least five to six targets a week. Uh, one target is not enough. That, that's, that's not enough. I need Han to catch the damn football. I'm not going to. Not going to absolve Jahan Dotson now. This is, not, this is not the Jahan Dotson pity party show. We're not doing that crap. But get Jahan involved, dog. Like. A screen and hit something. Get this man the football. Like, what the hell? Like, kid led the league, led, led rookies in touchdowns last year. I think he's going through a sophomore slump right now, which I'll talk about in another video later on this week. But I need Eric Bienman to get Jahan more involved. And I like he involved Chris Rodriguez yesterday. Do that more often, too. Like, I need to see more of that as well. Uh, get these guys the ball. And where's Cole Turner? That's another thing. He's the most explosive uh, athlete tight on the roster. Get him on the field and give him a, a target or two. God dang it. Does it have to be the exclusive of your Logan Thomas show? We can't run two tight end sets anymore and it not be John Bates with his slow, unathletic self? God dang. Like, comment, subscribe. Comment your thoughts. EB but yeah, like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Go subscribe to the DT Football Podcast YouTube channel. Subscribe all my bros down in the description. Go follow them still on Instagram. Uh, comment your thoughts on this video. Uh, I just want these young, you want these other guys to get more burn. In fact, Deami's getting more targets than Han. It's starting to get on my nerves, bro. So, um, 
I need more production for my wide receiver core outside of Terry. But I also need Eric Bien to put these people into position to succeed and get them the ball early. You know what I'm saying? Especially Terry. That's going to do it for me. Like, comment, subscribe. Comment your thoughts. Peace.